Hi everyone, welcome to the Essence of Life and this reading is going to be for all Aquarius in the universe, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. The messages may or may not resonate, this is a general reading. If you want a personal reading, my details are in the description below. So thank you everyone for watching, thank you for your time and your energy. I've done a pre-shuffle already so we can jump straight in. So the cards that flew out when I shuffled... For you guys true love this is the romance of a lifetime soulmate yes this is your soulmate children your love life is being affected by children uh, romantic feelings your feelings are real and worth exploring so let's get some tarot tap into the energy surrounding your situation do you remember energies can be vice versa or interchangeable there's no gender in tarot it's all just energy so please take the messages as it resonates for you and your situation so we've got the ace of pentacles ten of pentacles Page of Cups, Knight of Swords, the Hangman, Four of Swords, Nine, sorry, Four of Wands, Nine of Wands, Five of Wands, Six of Wands. Oh, wow. A lot of Wands. A lot of fire energy. Knight of Wands now. There's a lot of fire energy. You might be dealing with a fire sign. Or you might have fire in your chart. Page of Pentacles. Ace of Wands, more Wands. Wow, very fiery. Okay, so for some of you here, this situation looks like someone really missed out on a major opportunity to start something real with you here. Yeah, this is what it looks like. They feel like they really lost out on a good thing. So, yeah, I can see that some of you have got someone that's trying to talk to you here. They want to reconcile, start things up. They're trying to revive this connection with you again. Because this person feels like they had something good here with you. And this person clearly messed it up. We've got nine of wands. <laughs> Nine of Wands here. This person clearly feels like they messed up. They messed up. But at the same time, they don't want to give up though because they feel like you are a good thing. You're a sure thing here. They want something real with you, something tangible, long-lasting with that Ace of Pentacles here. This person feels like they really missed out on a good opportunity and uh, I'm hearing they feel silly. They feel silly about it. Yeah, so they want to talk to you. I mean, for some of you, Knight of Swords, they, they may have reached out to you already. They may have called you. You may be getting calls or messages from this person. But for some of you, you might not even be entertaining these calls. You're not taking their calls or responding to their messages. This person is trying to reach out to you. I mean, if you haven't heard from this person yet, then this person wants to reach out very soon. Yeah, because they don't want to give up. They don't want to give up on this. This person wants to rush in here passionately. So you might be dealing with a fire sign here. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. A lot of fire energy in this reading. So I don't know if you want to check out the Aries reading or the Leo or... Sagittarius reading to get more clarity here but yeah this person is very passionate towards you here but it looks like this person was attached to another situation we've got ten of pentacles here so this person was attached to another situation they were already committed somewhere else this person's probably got children they have a family outside of you or maybe you and this person. For some of you, you might have children with this person as well. 
you may have children with this person. So this is another reason why they're so passionate towards you. But for those of you who don't have children with this person, then children are a factor here because we've got Ten of Pentacles in reverse. So whatever family situation this person was attached to clearly is on the rocks right now. There's a lack of security there and this person is really reevaluating their position in their life right now because yeah it's there's conflict there's a lot of conflict in this situation as well a lot of disagreements you and this person is not seeing eye to eye this person is not seeing eye to eye in their other situation that they got going on there's just a lot of conflict and drama right now for this person yeah, and I think for some of you, this situation barely even got off the ground between you and them. Page of Pentacles in reverse. It didn't even get to get off the ground. Uh, you guys probably started seeing each other, started talking to each other. You know, probably rushed into things where you didn't really set a good foundation. So things didn't really get off the ground with you guys. There was conflict from early, from early, but there is feelings here, this is what I'm getting, page of cups, so there's feelings here, there is feelings here, I mean, this person, they see, um, they see stability with you, I mean, with you, they feel at home, this person feels at home with you, this is what I'm hearing. So, clearly, yeah, they feel like a failure in this situation here. This person, this lack of victory for this person. This is why they want to reach out. They feel like a failure. They failed in this situation here. They really missed out on a good thing. They want to reach out because they feel like you guys are meant to be. We've got soulmate here. This person feels like you are their soulmate. This is why they feel silly. They missed out on a major opportunity. They feel like they failed. Because this is true love. Romance of a lifetime. You bring this person emotional fulfillment in their life. They have so much feelings here for you. We've got romantic feelings. Their feelings are real. This person's feeling is real. They want to express how they feel. Yeah, because this person, they have a lot of regrets. They feel like they failed and missed out here. Missed out on a passionate new beginning with you. They missed out on a passionate new beginning. They want to... This person wants to reconnect. This person really wants to reconnect with you here. So if you haven't heard from this person, yeah, then this person wants to reach out very soon. Let's see what else is going on. Let's dig a bit deeper. Strength card, Leo energy. See, more fire energy. <laughs> Strength card in reverse. Yeah, this person. Oh, their, their pride and ego has just been shattered in this situation. That's what I'm saying because this person here, they don't have much confidence in getting back together with you. They don't feel like you would want to get back together with, with them. Because. Clearly. Things is not on the same page. Three of Wands. Three of Wands. So yeah. For some of you. This person's actually waiting for you. They're actually waiting for you. Wow. Wow. Two of cups in reverse, yeah. Failure. This person failed. They feel like they failed. Lack of victory here. Two of cups in reverse. So this person really wants to um, change the energy between you guys here. They want to open up communication. 
and hopefully that that conversation will just change the energy between you guys because this person is not going nowhere they're actually waiting for you some of them feel like they are waiting for you they're hoping that you will reach out to them you know I'm hearing, I'm hearing this person, deep down, they know that they may not hear from you again because they missed out. It's a it's opportunity gone. So I think they realise for them to regain this opportunity again, they're going to have to take action. Yeah, because this person, they were actually like, just not taking action, hangman. They're in hangman energy, just not taking any action, just hanging around, waiting. But it's just causing conflict, it's just making the situation worse. This is a situation where they're going to have to take action. Because by them not taking action, it's making, making things worse. Yeah. Yeah, we've got Seven of Swords. Seven of Swords. Deception. Seven of Swords in reverse. So, yeah. This person, they realise they have to stop deceiving themselves. Stop being deceitful. They want to open up here and just keep it real. This person wants to keep it real. About how they feel and what's going on. And what they want. Wow, it's Nine of Swords. This person is going through it, mate. They can't get you off their mind at the same time. You know, there's a lot of stress going on. There's a lot of stress. There's conflict that's going on with between you and them or between you and someone else. This person's going through it, mate. They've got a lot going on. And there's stress. This person's stressed because... I'm telling you, they really feel like they failed. They really feel like they failed here. Yeah, five of pentacles out in the cold. This person feels out in the cold. So they really want to come out of that, that energy of feeling out in the cold, feeling lack. Yeah, eight of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So, yeah, this person wants to make an effort here, put in the work, make an effort. Yeah, have a fresh start, justice. Yes, yeah, so justice is at play here. I mean, this is what goes around, comes around. So, justice, justice. Yeah, this person really needs to um, do the right thing. So they want to put in the work here. Yeah. They probably weren't putting in the work, making the effort before. But now, the universe is making them realise that they need to take things seriously here. Make, put in the work, make an effort. They need to make an effort. Take action, make an effort to make things right. That's the only right thing to do. We've got the tower. Telling you, major changes. So, yeah, major changes and shake-ups is, is happening here. Surrounding this connection here. Yeah, things is not going to be the same. Knight of Pentacles. So, yeah, this person wants to come in and put in the work. They want to come in and put in the work. Yeah, things is not the same. This is a major shake-up. This situation has shaken up. This connection is not the same again. Yeah, so... This person's in their head right now. Yeah, so you may hear from them soon. Yeah, because they're not going nowhere. So, we got a message from the Oracle. Cards communicate clearly. The message is, this situation requires very precise and careful communication. Don't assume that others involved understand what you want or need from them. In person, discussions are preferable, but if that's not possible, make sure that your communication method is very thorough. 
beautiful.